Some DP party members recently dragged the top leaders to court, accusing them of failing to hold a delegates' conference to elect new leaders. Now pressure is mounting since the party seems to be behind schedule ahead of the 2011 general elections. The National Council tomorrow is going to determine the date for the delegates' conference. Key on the agenda of the National Council meeting is the election of new leaders to steer the party to 2011. So the chairman of DP in all districts of Uganda are supposed to attend that meeting. Two, the National Executive Committee or the members of the NEC, they are also supposed to attend that meeting tomorrow. And the, all the parliamentary group, that is all DP members of parliament, and those who stood in various constituencies. Our concern is to have the, a framework, a time framework, when are we supposed to have the delegates conference and when and where the latest which we could have this delegates conference not beyond February early February early this month opposition political parties signed a coalition deal and part of the key issue is, is to have joint candidates including the presidential candidate but DP declined to join FDC UPC CP and Gemma However, Nsubuga says Tuesday's meeting will decide whether to ask party members on the way forward. The National Council will make recommendations that will go to the National Delegates Conference. So it is then that the National Delegates Conference will either mandate us to join IPC or not to join. But Kampala Mayor Nasa Sewagala, a DP presidential aspirant, thinks such a coalition will not help the opposition in defeating the ruling NRM. But is, uh, if I become a president general, my aim is to make sure, instead of say, the coalition, to, to build the party so that we can have a sufficient candidates from various uh, areas, from LC1. In 2005, we had the, uh, the DP delegates conference in Nambole. He stood, he lost, then he opted for the mayorship. That's why I see that is, uh, I'm not scaring about it. I was even ready yesterday in 26 to make sure that you go for these elections. But unfortunately, they know I've, uh, I've, I've been well, well, I'm going to take over the party. I think that's why they're saying that they're trying to dodge it. Sebagala, who spoke to NTV from his plush home in Bugolobi, a Kampala suburb, says he will join the ruling party if the aim is to extend services and development to Ugandans. I don't believe winner take all. So my ideology is to make sure that is we share the power not say that is one area it could be take over the power. Uh, I think this is now the trend of Africa now. When you look on Zimbabwe, this has been happening. You can experience in Kenya and other areas that are doing the same.